All right. Enough of that. We really should head home. Let's go. Wait. What? Ezio, let Christina sleep. There will be time enough for that. Later. Ah. So it's Vieri. You better hide. Keep looking! He couldn't have gotten far! Citizens of Pisa have held a mass demonstration once again sending Firenze a message of contempt. The city's youth apparently gathered. Christina! Christina! Who's there? Me! Oh, Ezio! I should have known. May I come in? Fine, but only for a minute. A minute is all I need. Indeed. Well, wait, uh, that came out wrong. Come here. Oh. oh, it's you. Oh, it's you. Christina! Christina! Svelia! Your tutor will be here soon. Come, my daughter. Is it really so terrible that... Figlio d'un cane! What is this? Perdonate, messere! Chiedo venia! I'll kill you! Oh, no, no. That's not necessary. Guards! Guards! Voglio la sua testa! Get in! Anato. There's We're really no need for violence. Let you! Get in! You have me confused with someone else. She needed some help with something. I'm mostly innocent. seen a stranger man through. Oh, come, don't be shy. Two or more critics. I'll throw in a small chapel size fresco. Two critics and altar piece and the portrait. <laughs> and I'll let you keep the art. <sighs> Hey, 
Good morning, father. Come with me. Is something wrong? Do you think me blind and deaf, son? I know all about your fight with Vieri di Pazzi last night. And then this little visit to Christina. Your behavior is unacceptable. It... It... It reminds me of myself when I was your age. I assume these misadventures won't interfere with your work today. No, Padre. Avete la mia parola. I've prepared some documents here for Lorenzo Di Medici to review. I need them delivered to him. With haste, Father. Return to me when it's done. Sempre. I have a letter for Messer Lorenzo. I'll see that he receives it when he returns. Returns? They've gone to Villa Careggi, I'm afraid, and not expected back for at least another day. I'll let my father know. Puppy, good work. Bischero. <laughs> you worry too much, Giovanni. Francesco. Ah. Hello, son. You remember my friend Uber? Good morning, Gonfaloniere Alberti. To you as well, young man. I trust you delivered the message. Si, padre. But it seems Lorenzo is out of town. Hmm. I did not anticipate this. What does it matter? So you wait another day or two. Listen, your mother and sister have been looking for you. I'll need you again in a little while, but for now, see if you can't help them. Are you sure? Yes, now if you'll excuse us. Good to see you, Ezio. Mm. Hey, Claudia. How are you? Bene. You shouldn't keep things from me. It's Duccio. What of him? I think he's been unfaithful. Who told you this? The other girls. I thought they were my friends. Harpies. You're better off without them. I loved him. No, Claudia. You only thought you did. He should suffer for what he's done. Wait here. I'll go have a word with him.
beautiful. Nothing but the best for you, amore mio. But what of Claudia? I thought you'd been promised to her. The father said I could do much better than an auditore. Ah, Birbante! Come, let us walk a bit. Walk? I had something <laughs> else in mind. Oh, Duccio. Mm. Mm. Hey, Lurido Porco! Ezio, my friend. You insult my sister. Parading around with his puttana. W what are you talking about? I saw the gift you gave her. Or the things you said. Maybe your sister shouldn't be so stingy with her virtu. You broke her heart. Ha! And now I'm going to break your face. You auditore is all topping. But when it comes time for action, ha! You regret ever opening your mouth. I could have taught your sister a great many things. She's lucky to have had someone like me. Bastardo! Ma che cosa aspetti? Basta! Mi arrendo! Stay away from my sister! out here, Petruccio. You should be in bed. I want those feathers. What for? It's a secret. If I get them for you, will you go back inside? Yes, I promise.
short supply of wheat from this year's harvest has pushed the price up six florins per hundred weight. And we are. I know that man. Here, as promised. Grazie, brother. You still haven't told me why you want these. I will, in time. Buongiorno, Ezio. Buongiorno a voi, madre. Come state? Sto bene. And you? Still recovering from last night? I have no idea what you're talking about. Of course not. Anyway, I have an errand to run. I'd like you to join me. Con piacere. Come, it's not far from here. I know about your fight with Vieri. What fight? Per piacere. Let's not play this game. He spoke ill of us. I could not allow him to continue. I'm sure he's having a hard time dealing with the accusations against his father. Francesco di Pazzi is many things, and none of them good. But even I never suspected he'd be capable of murder. What will happen to him? I imagine there will be a trial. Will father speak at it? He'll have to. He's the one with the evidence. Still, I wish there was another way. You have nothing to fear. Everyone wants justice done. It is an unfortunate state of affairs, but it will pass. Here we are. Hello, Leonardo. Madonna Maria. This is my son, Ezio. Molto onorato. L'onore è mio. Let me go and fetch the paintings. I'll be right back. He's very talented. Imagino. Self-expression is vital to understanding and enjoying life. You should find an outlet. I have plenty of outlets. I meant besides vaginas. Mother. Back to your house then. Si, si. Ezio, help Leonardo, will you? So Ezio, what do you do? He's been working for his father. Ah. You're to be a banker. For now. And you, Art, was it? Truth be told, it's been difficult oh. for me to settle. Painting is nice, but I often feel like my work lacks, I don't know, a purpose. Does that make sense? I'd rather contribute more practically, more directly. Architecture, perhaps, or anatomy. I'm not content merely to capture the world. I want to change it. Oh, Leonardo. I have no doubt you'll go on to... Thank you for your help, son. Don't let me keep you from your other duties. It was nice to meet you, Ezio. I hope our paths cross again. Anch'io. Ezio, come in, son. I need these packages delivered to associates of mine in the city. I also need you to retrieve a message for me from a pigeon coop not too far from here. Va bene. I'll get it done. Come back here when you're finished. There are some things we need to discuss. And please, my son, stay out of trouble. Hmm? Ma 
Did I just see that? I must be working too hard. You Giovanni's kid? No, idiota. He just happens to look exactly like the man. Give it here. Don't worry, boy. We're not contagious. At least I'm not. Delivery from Giovanni Aratore? Yes. Were you followed? No. Why would I be followed? Give me the package. Tell your father that they're moving tonight. He should as well. Who's moving? What's going on here? Wait! Come back! Explain yourself! Father? Federico! Oh, Serezio! Thank God! What happened? Where is everyone? They took your father and brothers to the Palazzo della Signoria. To prison. And my mother. My sister. Ezio. Claudia. Are you alright? Yes, but mother... She's in shock. They... when she resisted. It's not safe here. Is there some place you can take them? Yes, yes! To my sisters. Good, do that. In the meantime, I'll go see my father. Be careful, Messer Ezio. The guards were looking for you as well.
Ezio, father, what's happened? Took a bit of a beating, but I'm all right. What of your mother and sister? Safe now. Aneta took them. Yes. Wait, you knew this would happen? Not the way it did, and not this soon. Doesn't matter now. What do you mean? Explain! There's no time. Listen closely. Return to the house. In my office is a hidden door. Use your talent to find it. Beyond lies a chest. Take everything you find inside. Much of it may seem strange to you, but all of it is important. Do you understand? Yes. Good. Among the contents is a letter, and with it some documents. I need you to take these documents to Mr. Roberto. He was with me in the office this morning. The Gonfalonieri, I remember. Now please, tell me what's happening. Are the Pazzi behind this? There was a note for you at the pigeon. It said, go, Ezio. Go now! said there was a door here.
wanted to bring this to Messer Roberto. Traditore! Hey, what with the swords? Aren't you supposed to arrest me? No. There he is. What do you want then? You think you, you can, can get out of for you to die! Well, that's not going to happen. So why don't we explore other options? There are no other options! Felicinote. Much better, friend. You'll see. I'll throw in a small chapel size fresco. Two, three ticks, an altarpiece, and a portrait. <laughs> and I'll let you keep the artist for a week. Ezio Auditore? What are you doing here at this hour? It... I, I don't... Wait, child. Take a breath. Collect your thoughts. My father and brothers have been imprisoned. I was told to bring you this. Ah... I see now. It's a misunderstanding, Ezio. I'll clear everything up. How? The documents you've given me contain evidence of a conspiracy against your family and against the city. I'll present these papers at their hearing in the morning, and they'll be released. Thank you, Signore. Of course, my child. Do you need a place to stay? You're more than welcome here. No, grazie. I'll meet you at the piazza. Don't worry, Ezio. Everything is going to be fine.
Giovanni Auditore, you and your accomplices stand accused of the crime of treason. Have you any evidence to counter this charge? Yes, the documents that were delivered to you last night. I'm afraid I know nothing of these documents. He's lying! You need to get closer. In the absence of any compelling evidence to the contrary, I am bound to pronounce you guilty. You and your collaborators are hereby sentenced to death. You are a traitor, Roberto, and one of them. You may take our lives this day, but we will have yours in return, I swear we will! Father! Hey, grab the boy! He's one of them! I'll kill you for what you've done! Guards! Arrest him! Abba Tete. Better run, boy. And fast. I've got a little request for you. I've identified several strange markings that I've discovered right across Renaissance Italy. Now, I don't know what they're doing there, but I want you to help me find out. Rebecca has marked their general location in the database with an eye icon, and she's made them glow as well. Keep an eye out. Serezio, thank God. I've been looking everywhere for you. I couldn't stop them, Annetta. I tried, I swear. But there were so many guards. Please, come with me. We need to get you off the streets. What if my mother and sister... They're safe. I'll bring you to them. No. It's too dangerous for us to travel together. Tell me where to go and I'll meet you there. My sister's house. Just north of the Duomo. I'm on my way. That faithless husband of mine is cheating. I know it, as do all the neighbors. Please teach him a lesson for me.
Let me go. He's oh, okay. you can escape. The rats will have a rare treat this night. Freshly scored carne d'assassino. Don't try Keep away, dogs. Keep away, dogs. I give up. That's a bitch shame. I mean, wonderful wife of mine. Let me go home. Wait, Let me go. I have an appointment within the quarter hour. Oh, any last words for your wife? Get off me! I see you show him! Keep on up! I think we have the wrong building. No. No, this is it. It is a pleasure to make your acquaintance, Messer Ezio. Annetta speaks quite highly of you. I can see why. I appreciate the kind words, Madonna. Ti prego. Call me Paola. Thank you for offering your home to my family, Paola. It was the least I could do. You must be tired. Perhaps you'd... No, grazie. I can't stay. Why? Where are you going? To kill Uberto Alberti. I understand your desire for vengeance, but the Gonfaloniere is a powerful man. You are not a killer, Ezio. Spare me the lecture. But I can make you one. And why are you going to teach me how to kill? I'm not. 
I'm going to teach you how to survive. Come. Discretion is paramount in my profession. We must walk the streets freely, seen but unseen. You two must learn to blend like us and become one with the city's crowds. My girls will show you how. Bene. Now that you've learned to blend, I'll show you how to use it for more than just moving around. Let's teach you how to steal. Once you've stolen from someone, Ezio, you mustn't linger. You can go now, girls. Oh, do we have to? So innocent. He's cute. Now that you have learned how to approach the enemy, we need to find you a suitable weapon. What would you have me use? Ah, 
But you already have the answer. Hey, my father's blade and bracer. How did you get them? <laughs> By using the same skills I've just taught you. It's not exactly in working condition. I assume you're familiar with Leonardo da Vinci. See, si. what how does a painter factor into this? He's far more than that. Bring him the pieces. You'll see. Before I go, one last question, if I may. Of course. Why have you given your aid so readily to me, a stranger? I too know betrayal. Auditore, I I didn't expect to see you again. What with all that's happened? Ah, where are my manners? Welcome back. Now, how can I be of service? I was hoping you could repair something of mine. Of course. Come this way. Ah, che pasticcio. Tutto santo giorno che cerco. Let me clear a space. Eh? All right, let's see it. Fascinating. I don't know, Ezio. Despite its age, the construction is rather advanced. I've never seen anything quite like it. I'm afraid there's not much I can do without the original plans. Mi dispiace. Wait, wait, wait. What are you doing? The contents of this page are encrypted, but if my theory is correct, based on these sketches, it may very well... It may very well what? Please, sit. Leonardo, I... Shh, shh, shh. Remarkable. If we transpose the letters and then select every third... There! It's finished! Huh? What's finished? The blade. I managed to decode that parchment of yours. It showed me exactly what to do. Now all that's left is to remove your ring finger. Really? I'm sorry, but this is how it must be done. The blade is designed to ensure the commitment of whoever wields it. Bene. Do it quickly. <laughs> I was only having fun, Ezio. Though the blade once required a sacrifice, it's been modified. You can keep your finger. Incredible. Yes, it is. Tell me. Do you have other pages like this? I'm sorry, only the one. Listen, if you ever do happen across another one of these, please, bring it to me. You have my word. And thank you for fixing this. It... By order of the Florentine Guard! Open this door! Uh, just a moment. Wait here. Are you Leonardo da Vinci? See, si. how may I be of service? I need you to answer some questions. Certainly. 
What seems to be the trouble? A witness claims to have seen you consorting with an enemy of the city. What? Me? Consorting? Preposterous. When was the last time you saw or spoke with Ezio Auditore? Who? Non fare il finto tonto! We know you were close with the family. Perhaps this will help to clear your head. Ah! Ready to talk? What about now? Ah! What about now? <laughs> Grazie, Ezio. Sorry about that. Eh, uh, I've grown accustomed to their abuses. What of the body? Bring it inside and put it with the others. Others? The city gives them to me for research. Thank you, Leonardo, for everything, anytime. And remember, if you find more of those strange pages, bring them to me. Should they contain new designs, I will upgrade your blade as well. Of course. Now, I really should be getting back to Paola. Porgile i miei omaggi. Back any time. You were gone for quite a while. Leonardo likes to talk. That he does. But I trust he did more than talk. I've given you the skills. Leonardo's given you the blade. All that remains is the deed. Where can I find Uberto? According to my girls, he'll be attending an unveiling tonight of Verrocchio's latest work. It will be held at the Santa Croce Cloister. Watch over my mother and sister while I'm away. Of course, Ezio. As if they were my own.
I've traditional remedies and the wisdom of the Arabi. Again with this? You have overstepped your bounds, Uberto. Who are you to speak of bounds? You, who have crowned yourself Lorenzo di Medici, Principe of Firenze. I've done no such thing. Of course not. Ever innocent. How convenient. At least now, we see how far your reach extends, which is to say, nowhere at all. It has proved a valuable lesson for me and my allies. Yes. Your allies, the Pazzi. Is that what this is about? Be careful with your words, Lorenzo. You might attract the wrong sort of attention. That's a funny get-up. Trust you're enjoying yourselves. Indeed, a nice distraction from that nasty business with the auditor effect. To think I won't stop at Giovanni's. Oh. Don't blame yourself. How could you have known that he was I say we strike that traitor's name from the record books. Let you. You! Same. To save the ones you love. Yes, I would. And I have. Clear. 
I think it's best I leave Firenze. Where will you go? My uncle Mario owns a villa near Monteregioni. You're still a wanted man, Ezio. What would you have me do then? I've seen posters all across the district. Tearing them down will help the city forget your face. No doubt the Herald's also inside the public. Bribe them, and they'll speak of other things. Or you could hunt those who bear false witness against you. They traded dignity for coin. Their loss would not be mourned. Do any of these things, and you should be free to leave. I've added a program for tracking notoriety. This little meter will help you know how far you are between notorious and incognito. This will help you know if you should watch your actions. It'll also tell you if the notoriety level is part of Ezio's memory or not. Another capering crusader. Bentornato, Ezio. Were you successful? Yes. Madre? Ezio! Where have you been? They wouldn't let us leave. And Mother, oh, she hasn't spoken a single word since we left the house. Father will need to sort things out. Where is Father? And Federico? And Petruccio? Hmm? Something's happened. 
What do you mean? No, it's impossible. Claudia. No, 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 no. I did everything I could, Pichina. <laughs> Listen, right now what matters is getting us all someplace safe. But to do that, I need you to stay focused. Do you understand? Good. Will you watch over Mother for me? Then we are ready. Thank you again. For everything. Stay safe, Edzo. Stay vigilant. I suspect the road ahead is yet long. Here comes the Giovanni Signore, who's a prowess in the here. He'll beat the guards till tomorrow's end. All done. This way. Give me a minute. There is nothing for you here. Hey, Segue with me. The hand that deals in death so far does walk among his friends. And should the traitors rear their heads, they soon will be of their head. Sit tight. Andiamo. Stay put. Fall in. This way. How could this have happened to us? I don't know. Will we ever be back? I don't know. On me. What will happen to our house? I don't know. Were they... Were they given a proper burial? Yes. They were.
should be close. Grazie, Dio. Stay close. Buongiorno, Ezio. How could you leave a Firenze without saying a proper goodbye? Ezio! What do you want, Vieri? So many things. A larger palazzo, two new steeds, a prettier bride. Oh, and yes, your life. My condolences for the loss of your father and brothers. What will happen now that there's no one left to help you? I have such wonderful things in store for your mother and sister. I grow tired of this game. Finish him, and do not spare the women. What sorcery is this? <laughs> not sorcery, boy. Skill. Show yourself. As you wish. Here, use this. Kill them! Kill them all! my thanks. Keep the sword, Ezio. Do I know you from somewhere? Don't you recognize me? It's a me, Mario! Uncle Mario? <clears throat> it's been too long, Nipote. <laughs> Far too long. I heard what happened in Firenze. Terrible. Come, let's get you all away from here. Tell me everything. They executed father for treason. Federico and Petruccio, too. And they came for me. Do you know why? I have no answers, uncle. Only a list of names taken from a man who wished me dead. I still can't believe they are gone. Don't worry. We will make sense of this. I wish I shared your optimism. Come on, keep pace. We're almost there. I think you will find much to like in Monterey Johnny. I thought Monterey Johnny was an enemy of Firenze. For now. Next year it will be its friend, the year after its enemy again, and on and on. I cannot keep track, so I have stopped trying. These are honest, hard-working people. Our shops may only carry simple goods, but they're well-made and dependable. There is a chapel here, too. The British seems a nice enough fellow, but I have never been much of a believer. Did you know the Villa Auditore is almost 200 years old? It was built by my great-grandfather, a strange man who carried all kinds of secrets. Keep your eyes open, and you might discover a few of them yourself. With all the fighting that's been going on, this place has started to get a bit rough around the edges. I wish I could do something about it, but I just don't have the time or money to fix things up. Guess that's life, huh? Here we are, Casa Dolce Casa. So, what do you think? It's most impressive, Uncle. She's seen better days, I suppose. Believe me, I'd have her shining again if only I had the time. Now that you have had the tour, Nipote, you should go and outfit yourself. My men in the market are expecting you. Return here when you're finished, 
and we'll begin. Begin? Begin what? I thought you'd come here to train. No, uncle. I came here to escape Firenze. And I intend to take my family further still. But what about your father? He'd want you to finish his work. What work? My father was a banker. Wait. He did not tell you? I have no idea what you're talking about. Ma che me combini, Giovanni? Where to even begin? Go and fetch the gear in the market. It will give me time to think. But... But that's that. We'll talk more later. Some spending money should you need it. And if you find yourself in need of rest, I've prepared a room for you on the top floor of the villa. Ciao, signore. E buongiorno a tutti i amici. May wellness remain your companion, friend. Don't worry. We're only staying here for a little while. I don't like it here. I want to go home. I know. Salute, uncle. I did as you asked. 
And quickly too, ben fatto. Now, let's teach you how to fight. No, as I said, we are leaving. Ezio, you barely held your own against Vieri. You won't survive a week on the road. If you want to leave, so be it. But at least do so armed with the skills and knowledge necessary to defend yourself. If not for me, for your mother and sister. Fine. Ottimo. Well done, Nepote. You've really come into your own. Thank you, Uncle, for all you have given me. Your family. Such is my duty and my desire. I'm glad you had me stay. Good. You've reconsidered leaving. We sail for Spain in three days. But, Nepote, I have given you these skills that you might be better prepared to strike against our enemies. And if they find me, I will. You want to leave Ezio? To throw away everything your father fought and died for? To deny your heritage? Fine! Come voi! Arrivederci e buona fortuna! Uncle, wait! Why is he so upset? How can he not be? Vieri's been harassing us ever since you first arrived. To be expected, I suppose. Given his heritage. Uncle! Where is everyone? They ride for San Gimignano to slay that snake, Vieri. I wish to join them. You'll find what you need at the stables. Ezio, look at her. I still can't get her to talk. She spends all day and night in front of those feathers Petruccio used to collect. She can't let them go. I don't know what to do. Don't worry. She'll come back to us. I know it.
Ezio, what are you doing here? Taking responsibility. Vieri troubles you because of me. <laughs> Vieri troubles us because he's a Templar, and we are assassins. Either way, I wish to help. Va bene. Then listen close. First, we must find a way inside the city, though it seems Vieri expects us. He has sealed the gates and sent his men to guard them. Fortunately for us, the city is larger than his host, the southern gate suffers for it, so this is where we'll strike, pronti? All right, Ezio. Here's how it is going to work. My men and I will distract the guards. Once we have engaged them, get yourself over the wall and find a way to open the gate. Take these throwing knives. Use them to dispatch the archers. I'm ready when you are. Then let us begin. Al attacco! Well done, Ezio. We're in. This way, men! I want you to distract those guards and keep them from raising the alarm. Hopefully it will buy me enough time to find and silence Vieri. Va bene. Wait, Nipote. Take a few of my men with you, just to be safe. Come join me once they're dealt with. What's Vieri up to now? A lavo. No one knows, but something has him on edge. Whoa. How else to explain all the patrols? A signal we'll again when you should follow. Instead, he's turned this into nursemaids. And what? Shooting his mouth off again, no doubt. Angering the wrong sorts of people. And so now? Careful. Do you want to strike before him like Bernardo was? special place for Invicire like that. Okay. Attento! <laughs> Oh, my God. 
Ezio, your uncle's under attack and needs help. Go to him. Ah, Nicole. There you are. It seems my plan is something of a smash. Yeri's men ambushed us. Now we've got our hands on us. My brothers and I will deal with these guys. I want you to go on ahead and root out that snake. See that justice is done. one of the symbols. What does it mean? It must be there for a reason. Can you take a closer look? Hey! Try using eagle vision. I've got all day.
away, dog! Let you there! There! Get him! It's settled. Vieri, you will remain here to coordinate the mercenary. Francesco will organize our forces in the city and send word when it's time to strike. Jacopo, your job is to calm the citizens once the deed is done. What of that Ubriacone Mario? He continues to harass my forces, and I fear he'll discover what we intend. He's always been trouble, just like that bastardo brother of his. Then let me reunite them, father. There will be plenty of time to clean up the refute when we're finished. Now, is there anything else? Muy bien. May the Father of Understanding guide you. May, May the, the Father, Father of, of understanding, understanding guide you. Comandante! Comandante! What? Mario Auditore has invaded the city. He comes for you. <laughs> then let's not keep him waiting.
Ah, after him, ragazzi! What are you and your allies planning? Is this what my father discovered? Is this why he was killed? I'm sorry. Were you hoping for a confession? Pezzo di merda! Vorrei solo che avesse sofferto di più! Hai avuto la fine che meritavi! Spero che bru... Enough, Ezio! Show some respect. Respect? After all that's happened... Do you think he would have shown either of us such kindness? You are not Fieri. Do not become him. Che la morte ti dia le pace che cercavi. Requiesca in pace. Take this. Read it when you have the time. Our work here is finished. Let us return to the villa. <laughs> 